Greetings, one and all, it is I, Grayfall, back once again with another episode of Fallout New Vegas. When last we left off, we had just liberated the town of Prim from a bunch of powder gangers, and uh, to help keep them protected, we need a new sheriff. Our two options, if I bring on the map, are one at the NCR Correctional Facility, which is unlikely to be the one I'm going to choose because obviously one, it's currently inhabited by the Powder Gangers, so they're not going to like me much, and obviously the person in question is going to have been there for a reason, and I don't really trust that. Our other option is heading to the Mojave Outpost, where we will find uh, hopefully somebody willing to send more troops to Hayes over here, uh, in an effort to provide enough support that they can then cover the Prim as well as this route. Uh, there is canyon wreckage, that's going to be to one of the DLC. Might see that, we'll see. And uh, yeah, that's where we got to last time. So let's get ourselves over there. And there was a person there that just disappeared. Okay. Right, let's see where we are. So we've got a little, a little playground picnic-y type area. There is a teddy bear up there. I'm taking the teddy bear. Which apparently has weighed me down like nobody's business. My god, the teddy bear. The teddy bear has weighed me down. Right, dropping you. There we go, that's enough. Wonderful, let's see. Ooh. Got a coyote there. That would be a nice bit of experience. Come on out. Come on. Ooh, there's another one up there. Danger from... Who, from where, from what? Alright, let's go have a look at that canyon wreckage just so you can get a good glimpse of what we're going to be uh, going up against. Okay, I've attracted somebody's attention. up there. And there's some more up here as well. Uh, okay. Coyote pup, I think. Right. So, yeah, here is the canyon wreckage and the lonesome road. Ooh, hello. Duffel bag. Ten more rounds, bottle caps, empty syringe, and MRE. Yeah, some radix. I will ooh, take all of those. See if the yeah, so one more coyote up here. Apparently, will just not let me jump up there. So no mind. Ooh, there's a cave here. An NCR trooper. Ooh, hello. <coughs> right, so we've got uh, that. Some rounds. I will take the dog tags. Psycho, a service rifle, that's nice. Stim back and a squirrel, stew, and I've just gone over. That's annoying. I am now very. Ooh, I'll 
take you and take you. Right, so <clears throat> I'm now laden down. Um, right, let's see how much I can get rid of. So, uh, it looks like it needs to be quite a lot, to be honest. So let's just drop uh, character weapons. Uh, we'll, oh, 12 points. Yeah, we'll drop the incinerator on you. There we go. That's better. Here you... There we go. There's another one around here somewhere. I think it ran off the edge. Come back here. It's supposed to be the Alpha. Fight me. Oh. Okay. Um... Yeah, so now we've got ghouls. Uh, let me see, I don't want the submachine gun. Ooh, definitely don't want the grenade rifle. Uh, ooh, actually, I have quite a bit of ammo for that. Get the shotgun, though. Oh, that's going after that. Okay. Oh, God, we're on a bit of a... Uh, you know what? Fine, I'll leave you two to it. So yeah, ghouls for the uninitiated, and I'm hoping he doesn't come after me after this, um, is what happens when you get exposed to heavy doses of radiation uh, out in the wasteland. And some honey mesquite pots there. Um, it has pros and cons uh, of being a ghoul. Uh, pros being you have an exceptionally extended lifespan, so some ghouls can actually remember from when the bombs themselves dropped. Uh, bear in mind this is probably a good couple of hundred years since the fact um, and they also have increased I think energy and radiation resistance oh. yeah these see me I'm hoping he's the only one he's not the only one there's two of them there God, there's more of them. Oh, this was probably not the best weapon to use. Oh, God. Uh, take you. Grab a stim pack. Go back to my weapons. Uh, let's try the service rifle. You want to get rid of you? Ow, 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 ow. Ooh. That is close. I am probably one hit away from death. Um, super stim pack, regular stim pack, another suspect, sunset sarsaparilla. Uh, back to my status. Uh, doctor's bag. Put my limbs back to normal. Uh, so yeah, my HP is now back to there. I am going to want to probably switch to another weapon then from the side of this, because it doesn't look as though that one's being very effective right now. Oh, apparently I what? Oh, for God's sake. Apparently very slowed, and there is fire now over there. What the hell happened over there? Why am, why am I suddenly so slowed? Uh, effects. 
Headgear. Oh, Stimpak Sickness. Strength and Agility been dropped by one. Nuts. So that's effectively reduced my carrying capacity. Ah. Alright, we'll drop a few of these. Uh, drop a few more. Actually, uh, cancel. I'll drop these. And the knife? Yeah, there we go. Right, that should leave me just on the cusp. Okay. And then saying that, I actually go back to the aid, grab another couple of these. That'll help reduce things, because they're about... Yeah, they're one each. Okay, uh, and so yeah, there is apparently a drive-in over there, which is just outside of where the... Uh, the what do we call it? Where Commander Hayes is. So we'll leave that where it is. Something out there, but I can't see what it is. One of the weird things is, is that you can actually get birds showing up as these little bars underneath where it says northeast of my my compass. Birds will show up as as uh, people. Awesome, that's one down. See what you've got. Uh, no, don't want to get uh, more dynamite of that. Scroll on a stick. We'll leave that for now. Uh, now, where did your friend go? Ah, oh, there he is. Alright, so more ammo. Yes, please. We'll leave the cleaver. And make sure no one else is around out here. Caution. Ah, looks there's someone is. Apparently I have her attention already. There we go. One, oh god, there's another one. One down. Any more for any more? Yes, no, maybe. Going with no, awesome. Uh, you've got a 10 mil pistol, I'll take that and the psycho. Well, I'll leave the pistol behind, I don't need that. Uh, Jackal Gang Leader, ooh. Uh, okay, we'll leave that. Let's have a look in here. Highway patrol station. Hey. Your head looks mighty explodable. Hey. Yeah, it does. you taken care of. Whoop, more bugs. There we go. Anything in here? Oh, there we go. Cool. I can still grab it. But yeah, there was a uh, Sunset Sarsaparilla star uh, cap in there. Jack Spade's Lucky Teddy. So yeah, he's got some cards on him, which means it's going to be somebody who has, apparently, in his past, storyline-wise, has played some of the uh, Caravan game that got mentioned in uh, an earlier part of the game. Alright, I'll take those Hydras and... Ooh, ammo. Yoink. 
Right. And what do we have in here? Nothing. And, ooh, a very easy locked door. Excellent. Supposedly there's an enemy in here. Oh! You can just see his leg. And now it's dead. Uh, antivellum, healing powder, and a stim pack. I will take those. And you... Ooh, my debuff's gone. I'll take the cigarettes then. So while I won't smoke them, the... Uh... Ooh, guns and bullets. Yoink. They can be sold. Because everyone apparently likes to smoke still. Bottle caps, yes please. Nothing in this desk. Nothing in that desk. Filing cabinets are empty. Ooh, no, you've got something. Some money and some pre uh, and some bullets. And empty filing cabinets. Cool. Nope, you're just a sunset sarsaparilla lamp and an ashtray, which I don't want. What? Why would you want to carry an ashtray? Right, that. That out of the way. Carrying on to the Mojave Outpost. Oh, it looks like a fueling station over there. Let's see what's up there, shall we? See how they handle laser weapons. Not too bad. Although I'm using that up quite a lot, so. Mm. Bombing rifle, let's see if that's going to get against these guys. Ooh, back up, back up, back up. Don't attack me. Come on. Ooh, ow. Damn it. Not great, kind of have to admit. Sort of just trying weapons out just to see if there's any that uh, give me a good edge against these things. Because unfortunately, being large mutated scorpions, they've got armor. They don't really have a, a soft spot. Yeah, see? Ruby's casserole, which I haven't actually had a look at yet, to be honest. Let's, let's see if we can find that. Where is it? Ruby's casserole. Two rads, but plus one HP for 30 seconds. That's that's pretty good. So yeah, more of those, please. But for those, I will need glands, which these that one didn't seem to have any. Oh, there's a tiny one. And you are also empty. God damn it. Alright. Any more? Please be no. Looks like a no. Cool. And here we have a 
ghoul with some rather decaying hair. What a bright follower. Got a bright brotherhood robe. And a laser rifle. Ooh, that is tempting. Now that's just pushed me over, but that's fine. I can take one of these. We'll have a look in the store itself. So we've got various bits of food, but I can't pick this up right now because they'll just they'll just push me over. Money, on the other hand, I can take. Mayor Sten's journal, two of two. Ooh, 40 bottle caps, nice. I'll read that in a second. Uh, food, more food, and... Ooh, radix, that doesn't weigh anything, I'll take that. Wonderful. And... Pugilism Illustrated. Ooh, nice. Alright, let's have a look at that. Uh, misc... They didn't shoot the deputy. Deputy Beagle like you to find any... Oh, that's what we're doing at the moment. Guess whose luck keeps rolling? I can hardly believe my luck. Literally, I'm a gape. Just now, I was approached by a rather intense young man calling himself Mr. Fox. <laughs> yeah, right. When we were alone in my office, he let me know that he was a member of Caesar's Legion! Exclamation marks. He knew that NCR troops and powder gangers... Ooh, back in. NCR troops and powder gangers often spend time in Nibton. Turns out that the Legion hates and wishes to make an example of both groups. The NCR, for obvious reasons, and Powder Gangers for harassing Legion raiding parties on this side of the river. Didn't even have to think a moment about Mr. Fox's proposition before accepting it. All I have to do is convince the Powders to kidnap the NCR troops at night. When both groups are in town, the Legion boys will just scoop everyone up. <laughs> for this simple task, I have been offered 8,000 caps. I could almost go back to the NCR right away. But who knows how much else I could make off this Legion lackey. I'm going to start stockpiling some supplies in a safe house between here and the Mojave outpost, just in case I decide to head back home in a hurry. Very exciting. Signed with a steady hand on the keyboard. Super Mayor Joseph B. Stein, the third Esquire. Okay. So. Wait. What's pushed me over there? Because I seem to be... I didn't pick up anything? I'm a little confused there. Uh, we'll drop that, they don't weigh anything, and I'll drop the vault suit. That's fine. Okay, so let me get my rear in gear and get us to the Mojave outpost up there. See if we can get some more troops in. And who are you? You're a mercenary, but a mercenary for who? Ooh, is that a caravan? Ah, oh, yes, somebody I can sell stuff to. Where are you? No, no, seriously, where, where the hell's the mercenary? Oh no, the mercenary, the, uh, the trader. One, two, three. Oh, there you are. Hey there. Sitting down. Need anything? Yes, I I need your money. Sure. Here's what I got. All right. Let me go through and get rid of you. Get rid of you. Getting rid of all of you because I don't need them. Same with those. Same with that. And the single shotgun. Right. In return, I would like. We'll take the bobby pins, because they're going to be useful. Take the Temel cases. And... Medics. The Radaway, the Stimpaks. And, yeah, we'll take the that. Cool. That has considerably removed a lot of the stuff I've got. And... Freed up some more room for me. So let's get up here and see what we can do. That's uh, a rather interesting statue. Let's see what that's about when we get to the top there. And here we are at the top with these two rather impressive statues made entirely from scrap. 
That is very impressive. It would have taken a lot of work. I mean, it feels rather ostentatious, to be honest, but... Uh, the Unification Monument. In the year 2271, the Desert Rangers of Nevada and the Rangers of the New California Republic met at this spot to sign the Ranger Unification Treaty. Under this treaty, the dangerous Desert Rangers agreed to be absorbed into the NCR in exchange for NCR's protection of Hoover Dam, New Vegas, and Southern Nevada against the forces of Caesar's Legion. Cool. I do like the, uh, the, the desert trench coat thing. I really want one of those. And here we are at the NCR Ranger Outpost in the Mojave. You have a person here? Just, oh, you're just a caravaner. You're not a named person. Right, we'll pop that away. Hello. Hello. Right. And I'll have a chat with you. Caravan, citizen, pilgrim, or... Well, you sound like you're enjoying your job. Uh, Corey. Just need something for the logbook. Keeping tabs on traffic throughout the outpost. Although mostly just in. Not out these days. If you're looking for the commanding officer, he's in the back. Although, he's got a lot on his plate, so if you speak with him, keep it short. Also, if you need any gear checked, we can get you up and running again. Once you fill out the work orders and sign for the parts, of course. Uh, I'd like to talk to you about Prim. Prim? A's units are stationed up there. We're having problems with some of the NCRCF convicts. What can I help you with? Uh, he's under man and he's requesting some additional support. I'd like to help. We can't spare any more units. We have to maintain a minimum headcount at the outpost. Orders from the west. Mm, true, I can understand that. But having Prim and that trade route under the NCR control would really help the west. I see the wisdom in that. I'll radio for a unit to head up to Prim and offer some additional support. Cool. Uh, anything I can do to help out? Oh, well, you could speak to Ranger Jackson. He might have something for you. He sort of runs things around here. Mostly ends up sending reports back west that aren't filled with the best news. Oof. Fair enough. No worries. Let's Sir. have a look. Hello. Hello, Ranger Jackson. Ooh, have you got jobs for me? Ooh, hello. My god, look Looks at that like mustache. We got a new visitor in the old Brahmin pen. Not many people coming here in a hurry. Only passing through. And if you're passing through, you picked a bad time. Road north has gone to hell, and if I let a caravan through, they won't make it. Oof. Any way I can help? Help? No, look, I appreciate... Uh, you know what? Yes, I could use the help. And you look like you can handle yourself. I need to get the caravans moving again. That means clearing a path north. There's too much crawling the asphalt up the road to allow it. Yeah, sure. Thanks, I appreciate it. Come back here when you're done. I might accidentally lose some supplies to pay it with. Sounds good to me. Could I find in my heart? I probably could. And I know from previous playthroughs there is a lady up here that we can grab another quest from, although I can't remember exactly what it was. Hey there, lady. Uh, Ranger Ghost, is it? You a courier? If so, this might be your lucky day. If you don't mind walking a bit, and your eyes are good. Depends on the work. I think there's trouble in Nipton. No traffic from there on the roads. And while I can explain that away, the smoke from the town I can't. I'm sure it's been hit. What I need to know is if they survived it. Might be powder gangers with all that smoke in the air. If there's anybody left, they'd be in the Nipton Town Hall. Go there. Check it out. Let me know what you find. Yeah, if I pass through, I'll check it out. Better than nothing, but close to it. Listen, I don't want you getting killed for this. So if you head there and run into trouble, I'm asking for eyes and ears, not your life. All right? Cool. All right. I'll get going. Mind yourself on the plank going down. Yeah, somebody's at least considered his health and safety. All right. So uh, let's try uh, at least one of these quests. Uh, find it in your heart. Odd map. Ah, oh, okay. We, we were just there. Brilliant. So we just drop down to the Nipton Road stop. And then take care of whatever they need taken care of. Uh, let's go with a weapon that's not going to be worthwhile using. 
the good old pistol. It's a pest, you say. We could look at more of those little mantis things. I mean, that's not be a problem. We can easily take care of those. The scorpions, there might be a bit of a problem. Oh, crap. Run! Okay, giant ass. Did not expect that. I'm definitely putting more points into guns because that was a little harrowing and I definitely need those. Uh, speech is fine because the ones we've come across so far have been fairly low. I would like to work towards getting average locks being pickable. Um, um, but uh, we'll go energy weapons. We'll go energy weapons on this one. And you, my dear, are you even the mercenary that was with the... Uh, with the caravan trader, weren't you? Oh god. I think that feral ghoul... Nope. I think that feral ghoul from before has finally tracked me down. There you go. Also, that's my experience. At least I was hoping it was my experience. Guess not. Oh, we'll take those. Ooh, actually... Uh, yeah, we'll, we'll leave you because I've already taken most of your money. Right, let's get ourselves back up and uh, hand that question. I'll just reload that while I'm here. There we go. We won't go quiet. The Legion can count on that. Appreciate the help. Wish I had more work for you, but nothing else on the radar at the moment. That's fine. Uh, you mentioned a reward before. No, I mentioned you might accidentally get supplied, and I meant it. Not allowed to contract mercenaries at the outpost. Still, a requisition form or two can get lost, and they're not going to come check. So here you go, just between us. Cool. Ooh, another service rifle. Hey. Some armor, uh, piercing bullets, two caravan launches. And repair kits. Nice. Ooh, and bottle caps. Oh. Fine by me. Uh, actually, because I've already got one of the service rifles. There we go. I'll repair one with the other. There we go. That will keep my weight down, but just high enough for me. Cool. So, let me... Get myself in the right place. Okay, Dokes, so we've completed a, uh, a good enough part for here, so we've obviously gone and... Oh, wait, no, we haven't told Hayes yet. Yeah, we haven't told Hayes yet. All right, let, let me, let's go and tell Hayes that he's got troops now. That'd be marginally closer. Uh, you're over that way, okay. I wish there was an easy way to get around there. Um, a nice big pool of water. Unfortunately, it's going to be likely radioactive. Alright, we'll sneak in through this way. That should be fine. Yeah, there we go. Hi there, Hayes. I've got some... Oh, he was Lieutenant Commander. My apologies. I'm putting you well above your rank. Yeah. <clears throat> I got the extra troop support from Prem. Yeah, I just got word of that. There's a squad of Rangers standing by. Sergeant McGee will take over as Sheriff, and the Rangers will be his deputies. 
This town will be in NCR territory. This means that aside from protection, the citizens will also need to become registered NCR citizens and pay any appropriate and associated taxes. Eh, yeah, tell them to come in. Roger. I'll radio them over now. Cool. And that's that dealt with. Uh, I don't think we get any additional reward apart from the experience for it. Uh, and I don't know how happy the other people there are going to be about being under NCR rule because they're having to pay taxes. But it's probably better than the alternative, I would say. Um, right, let's see what my next quest is going to be. So I'm going to head to Novak through Nipton anyway. So that'll be the next one for us to do. And our closest spot's going to be from the road rest stop. So we'll jump back there. And we'll park it here for now. So thank you one and all for joining me on this adventure. Um, just spying where it says Lester above there. No idea who Lester is. Uh, but yeah, so as always, please like, share, subscribe, and all that funky jazz. And I will catch you in the next one. Bye-bye. Thank <laughs> you.